y'all, it's Taryn. Welcome back to my channel. This video we are doing an American Eagle haul slash review slash try on of some denim. So recently American Eagle expanded their denim jean size range all the way up to a size 24. Every single pair of jeans that they have, you can get up to a size 24. I've watched a couple of videos recently of other plus size YouTubers reviewing these jeans, so I figured now would be a good time for me to do it. I've done one American Eagle slash Airy video in the past, and I remember getting a pair of like their super high-waisted skinny jeans. They were a dark wash in a size 20 because that was the largest size that they had, and trying them on and they were so snug, like uncomfortable snug. <sighs> Y'all... <sighs> These are a hell definite no go. Oh, huh. Oh, Jesus. So, I am very excited to try these. However, with such a big range of styles, it's a little overwhelming. So what I did was I just went to the curvy jeans section under the women's section. That way it kind of narrowed down the different styles. So there are six total styles in their curvy jeans section on their website. So what I did was I purchased one of each style and I got different sizes. I got a 20, some in 22s and a couple in 24s just to give a full review so I could tell you um, based on what I think and my measurements, what size works best for me. Speaking of measurements, they're always listed in the description box down below and try on videos like this if you are interested. I am 5'8 for reference. If this is the first time you're watching me, then welcome. I also purchased all these when there was a sale. I believe it was buy one, get one half off. So six pair of jeans, I spent a total with tax, shipping was free, $269.28. Had they been full price, it would have been a little bit more pricey than that. So just keep that in mind too that um, their jeans are a little bit expensive, like regular price, maybe 60 bucks or so. Um, but if you hit them when they're having a sale, then you're good to go. So in true Taryn fashion, I am going to start with my favorite pair of jeans and then work my way down. So the first ones, are we not surprised that they're like distressed ripped jeans? These are called the Curvy Highest Rise Jegging. This, the names of these are going to all sound familiar, so listen closely because they're all different. These are in a size 20. I got these in long because I am 5'8", so I wanted to see if being 5'8", uh, made a difference in the length or if I was an average size according to their length standards. All right, these are in a light wash. Obviously a lot of distressing. I really like uh, the distressing at the ankle and stuff too. I thought was really cute. These fit like a dream. I mean, phenomenal. I tried these on with a cropped sweater. I don't own any cropped like t-shirts. The only cropped piece of clothing I have is a sweater. So I figured that would probably be best to show y'all the full jean with something cropped on. So these are absolutely adorable. Amazing fit. I love everything about them. I have nothing negative to say about them. The size 20 fit absolutely perfect in these, which is funny because like I said, the other ones that I tried on were way too snug. But these are, these are amazing. Next pair we have is black. These are called the Curvy Highest Rise Flare in bold black. I grabbed these in a 22 long and I specifically got these in a long because flare jeans to me, I think are so cute if you wear them with wedges. So I wanted them to be long enough to be able to wear with wedges and they absolutely were. All right, these, what surprised me and what I really did like about these is they have buttons all the way up versus a button and a zipper. It's buttons all the way up. These are super high-waisted, but these fit perfect. I mean, the 22 fits absolutely amazing. I love the flare on them. I will be keeping these because I don't own a pair like this. I don't have anything. I think I have one pair of flare jeans in my closet, and they're from Torrid, and they're dark denim. So having a pair of black flare jeans, I think... I would probably wear these a lot with wedges or something like I mentioned. I think sometimes too flare may look a little bit more flattering on me. Maybe not in the try on portion, but imagine them all done up with like the wedges and a cute top maybe tucked in or something because the flare just kind of evens out the appearance of my body, I feel like. So these next ones I need your help on because I kind of love them, but I kind of hate them. So I need your help. So these are called the Curvy Mom Jean in a size 22 and they're fitted like high-waisted and fitted around the waist and the hips they do button and zip but then it's kind of like they're a little bit baggy 
in the legs. Not baggy, but they're not skin tight. You know what I mean? And they're not long. They come like above the ankle. Ankle length, they're a little bit shorter. And they're not skinny on the legs or on the ankles. And so they're very different for me but I kind of love them. I also love the distressing on them, but these aren't actual holes. So it's like fabric is behind them, so you're not showing any skin or anything. And I don't own anything like this, so I kind of like it. So I need your opinion, do they look terrible? Be honest, I know y'all will be honest, but do they look terrible? Or are they kind of amazing? Now let's move on to just a pair of like this dark wash. I got these in just plain dark, no distressing, because I think these are really great for work. So these are called the Curvy High Rise Skinny, and these are in a size 24 long. I wanted to see how all sizes worked. These button and zip up. These fit too, so I think that um, because they do have stretch in them, I mean, they're a little bit um, looser than I would like in skinny jeans, but they do fit. I mean, there's nothing about them that's like too baggy or anything. Um, these are really soft material, skinny jeans, so they're not like super tight at the ankle, but they are tapered in at the ankle. Again, no distressing, no nothing on these. These are a little bit too long for me. So that tells me that I would need just a regular length in these kind of jeans, um, but they're nice. Like they're really nice quality. All right, now let's talk about these. These are the Curvy High Rise Jegging in a size 24, just regular length. When I think of jegging, I think of like leggings fit, but jean material, and that's exactly what these are. These button all the way up, instead of button and zip. But what I think is really cute about these is they have this little bit of like, cut out on the ankle. So these come maybe above my ankle, so I'm not sure if I would have needed the long to make them look like they did on the model, but I liked how they looked on me. So these fit really well too, size 22, super comfortable. They all say next level stretch, and I believe it because they hug you, like they fit perfect. Whew. And the very last pair of jeans, I think these are only last on my list because I needed them in a different size. These are a pair of white, and they're called the Curvy Super High Rise Jegging in a size 24, regular length, they have no distressing or anything on them, do they? Well, maybe right there. Maybe that's not supposed to be there, though. Hmm. Um, they are tapered at the bottom. I think they would be cuter if you um, rolled them a little bit, but that's just how I personally like to wear my white denim. These I tried on with a pair of dark underwear, like black underwear, and you couldn't see through. Like, you could not see my underwear through them. So keep that in mind, if you're looking for a great pair of white denim that's not going to be see-through, then this might be your absolute best bet. Again, it has that super stretch quality in it. I think that I would have really liked these, like I said, um, if maybe they were a size or two smaller. Now that you've seen everything, I will link it all in the description box down below. Check it out. That way, if there's something that you saw me try on that you liked, it's right there and you don't have to go peruse the website and find it for yourself. So that's a wrap on this video. The only thing I need help with, do I need the mom jeans? Let me know because I do like them and I don't own anything like it. So that's where I need your help. Yes to the mom jeans or no. And that's it. That's a wrap. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye. Oh, and my top is from The Limited. Remember I did a haul not long ago and I ordered this one in blue and loved it so much. They were having a 4th of July sale so I went in and got it in this green color. And I love it. I'll link it down below too. Okay, bye.